Hey, this is how to save printer presets. So if you want to set up a black and white mode and a color mode, it's pretty useful. So you don't have to go through all those uh, menus every time you print. Here we go. Uh, I start by working, working through Word. So opening a Word document and then going File, Print. Once you do that, um, you'll come up, it'll come up with a a print menu box, there we go. Uh, this box also comes up when you print PDFs or when you're printing from everything, but for some reason you don't always get the menu items that you do uh, through Word. So maybe you know a different way, but this is the way that I use. Okay, under this drop down box right here, its default is copies and pages. If you go into this drop down box, you can set um, any uh, you can change any print variable you want to and mostly people are going to mess with uh, color settings and then the layout and um, copies and pages of course um, so color settings is the one we're after color settings one if you go into color settings one uh, this drop down menu right here called color type uh, if you want black and white select mono uh, right there or black and white Okay, then go back. That's going to make this print, of course, print in black and white. Go back into uh, layout. If there's anything else that you use very regularly, like two-sided printing, okay, long edge binding is the regular two-sided printing. So select that. And then you can save this as a preset. So you go save current settings as preset. Click on that one and then give it a name that you recognize. Obviously, black and white's uh, pretty clear. Hit OK. And then black and white is going to come up as a menu uh, option, not a menu option, as an option under presets. Okay, so uh, let's create one as well for color. If you have anything you want to print color, you're going to go again to color settings. Select color this time and and then save this. And let's go back to uh, copies and pages. Um, okay, save this setting as another preset. So I'm going to call this color. And then when I open this print box, this print dialog box from any sort of print menu, Google Docs or a PDF or a Word, then those options should come up here as preset options. So you'll be able to click black and white or color or go back to default. There you go.